Hey everybody, welcome back, movie review time, where basically I geek out over a movie I just saw, and today I just set, finished watching Morgan. Um, so this is gonna be my no spoiler review, I'm just gonna take a couple minutes to give you my overall impressions and feelings about this movie, and if I say a spoiler, I'll cut it out so you're totally safe, I'm not gonna spoil anything for you. But if you do want to review with all the spoilers, you want to hear my, in, you know, my more in-depth thoughts, there's a link below in the description, or something's popping up right about now, you can click on that, check that out if that was what you prefer to see. Alright, cool. Alright, so overall, I gotta say, I really liked this. Um, I maintained a lot of the mystery. You know, I just saw the trailers, I haven't really heard anything about it, <clears throat> so I really didn't know too much of what's going on. So overall, I really, really liked it. It's dark, um, there's some brutality to it, there's some beauty to it, um, some great performances. You actually, you know, you care about every single character in this thing, good or bad. And, uh, you know, I thought, I did, I don't know if it was just a lucky guess, but I did kind of see one, there's a few twists at the end, but one of the big twists I did kind of see coming early in the film, but it may have just been, you know, kind of a lucky guess thing. I don't know that it was really telegraphed, um, but still, it didn't it didn't take my enjoyment level down at all. Uh, the pace of this movie, it just flies by. It doesn't feel rushed, but like, you know, the movie was over, and I'm like, what, what? I mean, it's like, it's only like 94 minutes, but still, you know, they get right to it. Um, the story unfolds great. Paul Giamatti's fantastic, as he always is. Uh, is it Ruby Rose, I think? Was the, or no, I guess it's Kate Mara. Why was I thinking Ruby Rose? I don't know. Anyways, uh, Kate Mara is uh, excellent in this, and I look forward to seeing her in more. Although now I'm thinking, and um, yeah, no, that's who it was. Okay, cool. And uh, <laughs> I really, really liked seeing her in this. Um, I like to see more of her. Um, the locations were good. The story is cool. Uh, I like, you know, that it's 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 kind of it's a modern day technology thing. I mean, well, almost modern day, maybe a little bit in the future. But if I had to nitpick things, and I won't go into detail here, but if I had to nitpick things, there are certain security issues with this uh, science lab that, with the nature of what they're working on, you think they might have had thought through a little bit further. Then again, that might fly in the face of the story. I'm not really sure. That's something I'm just gonna have to get more into on the spoiler video. But, um, yeah, I wasn't watching the clock on this one at all. I wasn't bored at all. I was just like, yeah, this is great. Let's see where they're going to go with this. And then that last act, man, that last act is pretty intense. And, uh, you know, I was like this through through a lot of moments of it. Because, um, you know, you just know certain things are going to happen and you don't want it to happen, but it's going to happen. Uh, so you're kind of filled with a certain level of dread, uh, which is very, very nice. You know, they really, they really did well with the emotion. Uh, cinematography is fantastic. Lighting, uh, location design, costuming. I love what they did with Morgan. They made her kind of gray-skinned a little bit, but in that way where you keep looking at her like, something's wrong here, but I can't put my finger on it. Like, I do wonder if they've, like, CG manipulated her a little or something, because you can't really figure out what, you know, she doesn't quite look uh, normal, so, you know, but that's what, uh, I think that may be part of the point. Maybe, maybe not. Um, you've seen the trailers, you know, I, I, I can at least talk on that a little bit. But uh, yeah, no, I really, really dug it. I actually, I really do uh, recommend this. Of course, I got the Blu-ray, DVD, digital HD. Um, anything else? It's from Scott. It's from Ridley Scott's production company, directed by Luke Scott. So is this another Scott? Um, I wonder if he's actually related. Interesting. But yeah, really good sci-fi, really good action. Just, just really, really good. I highly recommend it. So Morgan, check it out, man. I, I it's got about my, my two. I uh, can't say two thumbs up, can I? It's kind of ripping off. Um, no, I don't need to make a dirty joke. Anyways, that's what I think about it. If you guys want to tell me if you just enjoyed it or not, that's cool. You can do that in these comments, but no spoilers in this thread, please. If you do want to talk spoilers, jump on over to the spoiler video, and we can spoil all we want there. So speaking of that, I'm going to get out of here and go do that. So give me the thumbs up. Give me the thumb of encouragement. It is wonderful to be encouraged, and I'm going to go shoot the spoiler video. I will see you guys later.